Good morning. My name's John Latter. I'm on the White Cliffs above Dover Harbour to make a rough and ready video of the Disney Magic cruise ship. I'm not particularly high up on the cliffs, but if you're concerned about heights, it might be best not to look down. I said, oh, never mind. A distant view of the Disney Magic in the Western Docks who arrived in Dover exactly two weeks ago today on Tuesday the 19th of May 2020. She wasn't carrying any passengers of course but she did have crew members from the Disney Fantasy and the Disney Dream on board who were waiting for repatriation. Some of the cruise ships that visit Dover look like floating blocks of flats or apartments as they call them in the colonies but the Disney magic is reminiscent of ocean going, outgoing liners such as the uh, Queen Elizabeth, Queen Mary, Ile de France, Normandy, beautiful ship. The Disney magic is nearly a thousand feet long, over a hundred feet wide and has a tonnage of 83,000. She can carry between 1,700 and 2,700 passengers and has nearly a thousand members of crew. Came into service in 1998, built in Italy and is registered in the Bahamas. A view of the upper decks. I'm resting the camera on a fence post because I haven't got a tripod with me. If I drop down at the stern, without shaking the camera too much, there's the figure of Goofy painting the ship. The starboard side of the Disney Magic viewed from part way down the new marina pier and a close up of Goofy. A view from the end of the marina pier with my bike in the foreground. A view from St Martin's Battery on the Western Heights. A different part of the cliffs to where I started. And a final shot from inside St Martin's Battery.